Welcome back to the McCall's Baking Channel. Do you love gold? Do you love desserts that look luxurious? Well then we have a cake for you. Our gold cake is covered in gorgeous, shiny, metallic gold and will be a true showstopper at your next event. Follow along as we show you how to easily make this stunning cake right in your own kitchen. Let's get started. To make our gold cake, you will need McCall's Easy Ice Rolled Fondant in gold and yellow, gold sprinkles, gold gel food coloring, gold airbrush food coloring, McCall's Gold Luster Dust, gold drip icing, white fondant leaves, and two sizes of gold gum paste roses. We will be showing you how to decorate a gold cake using a styrofoam dummy cake. However, the steps for decorating will be the same when you use a real cake. We cover the styrofoam in clear gel glaze to help the fondant stick. When you use a real cake, the fondant should stick right to your buttercream crumb coated cake. Knead the gold fondant until it is nice and soft. Use a rolling pin to roll the fondant into a large circle. Use a small amount of cornstarch to prevent the fondant from sticking to your work surface. The fondant should be nice and flat. You can use a fondant smoothing tool to make sure the fondant is uniform and smooth. Brush the fondant with the McCall's Gold Metallic Dust. Roll the fondant around your rolling pin and use the rolling pin to lift the fondant off the table and drape it over your cake. Use your hands to flatten the fondant on top of the cake and then gently guide the fondant down around the edges of the cake. Start from the top and work your way down the sides, smoothing the fondant and pulling the bottom down as you go. Use a small pizza cutter to remove any excess fondant. Wrap up any extra and save it for your next gold project. Use a fondant smoothing tool to make the sides of the fondant on your cake board perfectly smooth. A small pin can be used to pop any air bubbles in the fondant. Cut away any last remaining fondant, making the fondant edge flush with the cake board. Rub on more of the metallic gold dust, covering the cake completely. You want a lot of that beautiful gold shine. Squeeze the gold drip icing around the top edge of the cake, letting it drip down the sides. Try to make some drips longer than others. Mix some of the gold dust into a small amount of buttercream. Add a little metallic gold food coloring as well. Scoop the buttercream into a piping bag fitted with a large star piping tip. Pipe a shell border around the bottom of the cake. Use the same star tip and piping bag to pipe gold rosettes around the top edge of the cake. Scatter some gold sprinkles around the top of the cake. We use gold coarse sugar and gold sprinkles. Mix a little gold dust into some clear gel glaze and then scoop it into a paper cornet. Pipe a decorative border around the cake board. This adds an extra fancy touch and makes your cake look even more professional. It's all about those small details. Use an airbrush and gold airbrush food coloring to spray the white gum paste leaves gold. If you do not have an airbrush, you can also simply dust them with gold powder as you did with the cake, using a small paintbrush or even just by rubbing the metallic dust on with your finger. Press the gold gum paste roses into the buttercream at the base of the cake. Try to use large and small roses in each cluster for a nicer look. Place the gold leaves in between the roses. Have you ever seen such an amazing gold cake? This is sure to wow all your friends and stand out in your dessert buffet. This cake will be perfect for a special birthday, a New Year's celebration, or just about any occasion where more gold is needed. If you had fun watching this and making this amazing gold cake, then be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel today. We make new, exciting baking videos all the time. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram for more baking tips and tricks. Everything we use to make this gold cake is available at mccalls.ca. Once you have made a gold cake of your own, tag us at Love McCalls. We want to see what you create. We'll see you next time.